What's up folks, DC here with Tried and True. Um, bear with me today, it's just me here in the shop. So I'm gonna take you on a little walk around of the new Battleborn M1. Let's check this thing out. Starting at the front here, we got the fully articulating max coupler hitch, uh, which is removable too if you wanted to go a different route. Still got a couple things to do up front, getting the safety cables on and whatnot. Got a two foot by four foot rack. Actually put a channel in right here. This allows you to hook bungee cords and straps and come over this way as well. So you have, have two directions. You can run some straps there. Full size matching spare tire. Got it mounted up there. A place that usually gets kind of wasted for space. So we stuck it up there. The Battleborn M1 logo. Those of you that aren't familiar with that, I had a buddy that I lost last year. And, and that was one of his favorite songs. So. Gave us the idea for that. I think you'd appreciate that. Got the removable leveling jacks. Plenty of room to spin those. Very solid. You can walk on all this stuff. It is solid. The roof rack's actually eighth inch thick, inch and a half square tubing. You can see all the places it's welded. It, it ain't going nowhere. Coming around the back. Got the tried and tube. Had that laser cut out of eighth inch strap. I put the tail lights in the door. Um, reason being that I didn't want any wiring underneath the trailer whatsoever. So all the wiring will actually run through through the box and into the tube and up front to the four pin connector. Got the fold down table. This has been popular on the sleeper campers. It's four foot by twenty two inches. You got all kinds of room right there. like that nice and easy no reason to over complicate things well there you have it folks any questions let me know do one last walk around here let's talk some pricing um, if you've done much research in this market at all you'll, you'll find that most of these trailers pretty similar start around the seventy five hundred dollar mark um, a big thing to me has always been affordability and trying to get trying to give as many families as possible access to these things that being said uh, the Battleborn M1 is going to start at sixty four hundred dollars so about eleven hundred dollars cheaper than the average and with Veterans Day being yesterday, Thanksgiving around the corner, I'm gonna take an extra thousand dollars off of that for the rest of 2021. So all orders placed on this model between now and the end of the year will be $5,400. As of January 1st, 2022, it'll be back to 6,400. So hit me up quick, get on the list. Let's get you that discount. This thing is solid steel, tough as hell. There might be some prettier stuff on the market, but there will not be stronger stuff, I can promise you. You can pass this thing down to your grandkids. So I appreciate it, guys. Please like and share this video. Let's get this thing spread around. Appreciate it. Thank you.